Good day, YouTube. This is Jay Money with Falling Forward Financial. Uh, just an update here on uh, Lee Otto. Uh, I've talked about them on the channel. It's uh, been a while since I've talked about them. I uh, did a video on uh, NEO earlier, uh, why it's down, why some of the uh, Chinese stocks are down. And I uh, just got a bunch of info to go over here on um, Lee Otto. So, uh, again, this is Lee Otto, ticker is LI. So they're down over 32% in the last year, so just really up and down. I suppose if you wanted to trade this one and hit it at the uh, good point, you could probably make some money trading this one. But um, again, I don't give tax, legal, or trading advice, but you could make 50% there. But just a thought. In the last uh, three months, they're down over 42%, and they were trading pretty much flat here, up and down, and just a big drop off here lately. Here in the last month, down over 41%. Here in the last week, down over 30%. And here's a look at today. So this big uh, drop off. Um, I'm toying with the idea of uh, buying some. Um, I mean, I don't know if they're going to go much lower. But um, uh, I will link my uh, um, Neo video in the uh, description as well. Uh, you might want to watch that and make a decision after watching that. But um, like I said, I can't tell you what to buy or sell so, but um again Leato as you can see I have three shares here at a cost basis of thirty five oh four so I'm down over fifty percent. Uh if you don't know much about them, they're a holding company which engages in the design, development, manufacture and sale of electric vehicles. So say what you want about them, it's the wave of the future. That's why I'm uh, looking into them and investing into them um slowly but um surely Biggest holding is probably with um, share wise is Ford, then probably GM. Uh, dollar wise is probably um, Tesla, and then I have just a couple of these um, Chinese stocks. So um, it's more in a retirement, uh, not much here in uh, Robinhood. But so Lee Auto has been around since 2015. 38.78 million uh, shares. It's um, almost tripled uh, what the average is. Market cap of 21.9 billion. I'm sure that's cut in thirds or a half. 52-week um, low of 15.98, high of 37.45. So, um, and I'm right about at the high on my cost basis. So I got into these a while back. 89% uh, buy rating. So we'll see if that uh, changes in the next uh, couple weeks or not. Next uh, earnings is expected on uh, May 26th in the pre-market. And here's where I bought mine back in November of uh, 2020, 35, 33, $37, so pretty much at the high. Um, but I'll probably be doing a, a video here on the XPing as well. It looks like that's down as well, but um, unfortunately. But over here on uh, Microsoft Bing, currently showing it as a buy. And analyst has set. Lee Auto Incorporated target price at 41.43. Keep in mind, this is a little over a week old, so um, this really isn't even relevant. Uh, but I still wanted to point this out, uh, just because the average 12 month objective among analysts uh, that have covered the stock in the last year is 42.61. Uh, so if that holds true in regards to uh, what just happened today, it's um going to be hard to uh, say what will happen with this one, but just wanted to point that out this article as well. But since it's a little bit older, we're just going to skip over that one. But uh, Royal London Asset uh, Management Boost Holdings in uh, Lee Auto Incorporated. So they uh, buy 3.3% uh, during the fourth quarter, according to its most recent 13F filing in SEC. Institutional investor owned 687,100 shares of the company's stock after purchasing an additional 21,800 shares. And so, this is also a uh, day or two old. So, well, I guess it just came out yesterday, uh, being today is the 14th, but um, maybe they're wishing they hadn't have bought it now since it took a major drop, but. Um, yeah, hold it. Maybe it'll come back up. So, but Liano announces inclusion of the shares in the Shenzhen Hong Kong Stock Connection Program 
and this is just uh, 10 hours ago. So, uh, Li Auto, an innovator in uh, China's new energy vehicle market, uh, today announced that the company Class A Ordinary Shares, which are listed and traded on the uh, SEC Exchange of Hong Kong Limited, have been included in the Shenzhen Hong Kong Stock Connect program, effective on March 14th of 2022, based on the announcement of the Shenzhen Stock Exchange. Inclusion uh, Connect the program allows the uh, company to access, access a broader investor uh, base and uh, share its uh, growth trajectory and further success with users, partners, and investors in mainland China via the financial market. The company was selected as a uh, constu constu <laughs> I can't say it, constitute it, whatever. We're going to skip that so you can insert laugh there. Uh, stock of the uh, Hong Hang Seng Composite Index and its sub-indexes, uh, including the Hang Seng Composite, a large cap index on August 26, 2021, uh, which is a great date, and was selected as a stock of the uh, Hang Seng on March 7th of 2022. So the program is a mutual stock market access mechanism under uh, which the uh, Shenzhen Stock Exchange and Stock Exchange of Hong Kong Limited have established technical connectivity to enable investors in mainland China and the Hong Kong Special Administration re region to trade eligible shares listed on each other's market through their local securities companies or brokers. Here's a little bit more about uh, Li Auto. Again, it's an EV. The mission is to create homes on the move that bring happiness to an entire family. Through innovations in uh, product technology and uh, business model, the uh, company provides families with safe, convenient, and refined products and services. And feel free to pause and uh, go over the rest there for yourself. Market analysts uh, see Liato gaining to $38 a time to buy. And this is actually came out today, so maybe the analysts are sticking to it. Uh, even though it has uh, dropped off majorly, maybe that's just a major emotion in the um, trading world, so we'll just have to see. Traded at a low on 3-11-2022, posting a minus 14 0.70 loss after uh, which it closed the uh, day session at 22.17. Company report on uh, March 11 that uh, Kang and December quarter results uh, met expectations, but soft uh, revenue guidance for uh, March quarter should uh, mark a quarterly uh, through our trough for 2022. Results of the trading session uh, contributed so over uh, shares changing hands over the past one week, the price volatility of Liato stands at 10.18%, while the volatility over the uh, past one month is 7.32%. Uh, here's what uh, market gurus are saying about uh, Li Auto. And we'll go over some more ratings here at the end. So, I don't know, with these prices taking a dip, it's um, so tempting to pick up a couple shares just to uh, lower my cost basis, but um, I'm still uh, researching it and uh, watching this one, all three of them actually, so take note of the uh, trade activity, Lee Otto and here today, so I suppose there has been a bunch of uh, trading, uh, but valued at $25.99 in that particular session, the stock kicked off the price of $26.82 while reaching a peak of $26.83. Lowest uh, value recorded on the day was 21.92. The stock current value is 22.17. Recently in news on uh, March 11, 2022, uh, December quarter results uh, met expectations, uh, but soft uh, revenue uh, guidance for uh, March quarter should mark a quarterly for the 2022. So we'll just have to wait and see on this one, and might need to watch this one a day or two and. Um, See what's going to happen with it, but 52 week period uh, managed to maintain the performance between 1598 and 3745. So, over here on uh, Reddit, 
Liado new SUV L9 uh, spy shots leaked. Uh, so they do have some new products coming out. Neo versus Xping versus Liado. Uh, you can verse them all day, and who knows who will win. Uh, so I just um, instead uh, buy a little bit of each and uh, see which one turns out for the best. And they're all going down the uh, crapper today. So, but. <laughs> Over here on uh, MSN Money, currently showing it as a buy. And that'll be interesting to see if that changes in the next day or two or a week. Over here, a strong buy on um, tip ranks with 145% upside to 43.33. High of 49 and low of 40. But that's all that I have on uh, Lee Auto. If you have uh, Lee Auto, go ahead and list it in the uh, comments along with your cost basis. And if you bought any on the uh, dip today, at uh, 1760 looks like 1759 1755 is showing the low so 52 week low of 1598 i suppose it hit that just recently here but but like i said if you have this one list it in the comments along with your cost basis any other information you'd like to share on this one or anything in regards to um chinese stocks in regards to uh, all of them, um, like I said, I'll watch the uh, video that I did earlier in regards to uh, Neo. It kind of goes over all the um, uh, Chinese stocks. So, and if you haven't smashed that like button yet, go ahead and hit that for me as well as subscribing and hit the bell so you're notified of when the next videos drop. Again, this is J Money following Ford Financial. Happy trading, happy investing. Stay green. Cheers.